In a chilling revelation, French investigators have unveiled a startling piece of the puzzle behind the tragic Air France Concorde crash that shook the world just last month. Flight 123, this is Control Tower. You're cleared for takeoff into a world where aviation history unfolds, revealing untold stories of triumph and tragedy. Welcome aboard to Aero Accident, and buckle up for a captivating journey as we unravel the mysteries of the skies together. It all started with a minuscule piece of metal lying inconspicuously on the runway, an unassuming object that would prove to be the catalyst for a catastrophic chain of events. Unleash the truth of a fateful crash? French investigators unveil a single piece of metal that triggered a catastrophic chain of events, unraveling the delicate balance between aviation safety and disaster. Join us on a gripping exploration of forgotten objects, a burst tire, and an inferno in the skies. As the Concorde thundered down the runway at Paris's Charles de Gaulle Airport, ready to defy the skies once more, fate had other plans in store. That unremarkable metal fragment shrouded in mystery, mercilessly sliced into one of the Concorde's tires, tearing it apart with a thunderous explosion. The forceful rupture propelled fragments with deadly precision, piercing through the vulnerable fuel tanks nestled within the supersonic aircraft's left wing. Within seconds, a nightmarish scenario unfolded. An unimaginable deluge of fuel gushed forth, igniting an inferno that engulfed the stricken jet in a tempest of flames. A terrifying spectacle ensued as the crippled conquered, now a blazing beacon of destruction hurtled towards a small hotel located perilously close to the airport. The outcome was devastating and heart-wrenching. Every single one of the 109 souls aboard the ill-fated plane, along with four unfortunate occupants of the hotel, were tragically snatched away. This revelation exposes the extraordinary chain reaction set in motion by an innocuous piece of metal forever altering the course of that fateful day. Amidst the veil of uncertainty surrounding the tragic Air France Concorde crash, the French Transport Ministry's Accident and Inquiry Office has shed light on a perplexing discovery. While the origins of the enigmatic metal fragment remain elusive, investigators have determined that it bears an uncanny resemblance to the incision found on the ill-fated Concorde's tire. Yet the full sequence of events leading to the plane's catastrophic downfall still eludes their grasp, leaving crucial questions unanswered. What remains a haunting enigma is the pivotal question of what ultimately sealed the Concord's fate. Was it the blazing inferno or some other devastating damage that caused its demise? Scrutinizing the flight data recorders, investigators were jolted by the revelation that not only did one of the four engines fail, but another also suffered a loss of power. This grim detail suggests that the aircraft endured more than just punctured fuel tanks. It likely endured the merciless assault of debris, potentially swallowed by its mighty engines. As the investigation unfolds, it is a somber reminder that the Concorde has long been plagued by tire troubles since its maiden voyage in 1969. Unlike their subsonic counterparts, these supersonic marvels soar through the heavens at mind-boggling speeds, subjecting their robust 47-inch diameter tires to unimaginable stress. The force of a tire blowout can possess a detonation so forceful that it threatens not only the engines, but also neighboring structures, including the delicate fuel tanks. While subsonic planes may suffer from blown tires, their energy pales in comparison, seldom posing a grave menace. In the face of this disquieting revelation, one thing becomes abundantly clear. There is a precarious balance between engineering marvels and the dangers that lurk beneath their soaring wings. In a gripping revelation, the French Accident Office has disclosed a crucial detail about the ill-fated Concorde's final moments. Picture this. 
The Concorde, that engineering marvel of supersonic travel, hurtled down the runway at a breathtaking speed of 170 knots, equivalent to a staggering 195 miles per hour. Yet tragedy struck as one of the tires succumbed to the immense strain and burst into fragments. It is worth noting that the Concorde's takeoff speed stands at a mind-blowing 220 miles per hour. Hey there! If you're hooked on the video, subscribe now for riveting updates and captivating content. Don't miss out on the latest news, insightful articles, and engaging discussions. Peter Duffy, one of the revered pioneers among the original Concord pilots, unveiled a startling fact in his captivating 1999 book, Comets and Concords. He emphasized that during takeoff at maximum weight, the aircraft teeters on the press of its tires' endurance. Should the Concorde exceed its designated speed on the runway, the tires risk being cooked, weakening them for subsequent takeoffs. Imagine the terror of realizing that the very lifeblood of control and safety, the hydraulic fluid, had leaked away, leaving him devoid of brakes. It was only through the sharp eyes of a vigilant maintenance worker who spotted the fluid trail and dashed onto the taxiway, frantically signaling Duffy to coast to a stop, that disaster was narrowly averted. Prepare to be gripped by the harrowing account of a near catastrophe that was a mere breath away from transforming a majestic aircraft into a weapon hurtling towards a terminal building. A seasoned Concorde pilot, Peter Duffy, vividly recalled the heart-stopping moment when disaster loomed just moments away, a sharp-nosed descent that would have thrust the aircraft directly into the bustling main terminal building. This bone-chilling incident raises a vital concern, one that demands unwavering vigilance from airports and airlines worldwide. The ever-present threat of Foreign Object Debris, FOD. Runways undergo meticulous inspections to rid them of any lurking foreign objects. Waste cans proudly displaying the label FOD are strategically placed near gates and maintenance facilities, beckoning employees to discard anything that could imperil an airplane's tire, be sucked into an engine's hungry maw, or even pose a hazard for unsuspecting individuals. The catastrophic rupture of the tire propelled by the Concorde's blistering speed of approximately 170 knots unleashed a terrifying storm of large, high-energy fragments, some weighing over four kilograms. In a whirlwind of events yet to be fully comprehended, these fragments swiftly inflicted damage upon one or more of the fuel tanks nestled within the left wing. The consequences were dire, a deluge of fuel cascaded forth, triggering a voracious inferno that consumed all in its path. The investigator's startling revelation indicates that the section of the fuel tank discovered on the runway indeed originated from tank number five, situated precariously above the left landing gear, jutting forward and slightly to the left. Only through tireless investigation and unwavering commitment can we unravel the complexities that lie at the intersection of human achievement and the treacherous allure of the unknown. And that's a wrap, folks. Thanks for joining us on this captivating journey. If you want more engaging content, be sure to check out our other videos on the channel. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and leave your valuable comments. What other topics would you like us to explore in future videos? Stay tuned for more exciting updates. See you in the next one. Bye!